The PS30 has been installed and commissioned in the last tutorial as well as the display items have been presented. Now a teach in will be done directly at the sensor's display. Our PS30 demo case is used again. By pressing the set button for longer than 2 seconds one gets to the main menu of the sensor. The item teach in is selected directly. There are the items start length teach, offset as well as blanking available. Blanking defines certain areas which are then not considered for the teach in. First, the item start length teach is selected. The label length is now requested and for the sick label the length is 145 mm. Here it is important that the set value for the label length is not longer than the real length of the label. Each single number can be set and changed. The setting needs to be confirmed by set and the drum turned. The label now passes the sensor. When starting to turn the drum the sensor should be positioned at the beginning of the label. The word busy on the display indicates that the sensor is processing the picture data. After this process up to six blinking bars show the quality of the teach in. In the endless mode the sensor is now switching at the beginning of the label. In the single object mode the sensor is now switching at the end of the label. After a few rotations the bars stop blinking and represent not any longer the quality of the teach but the quality of run which means the quality of label detection. The next step is now to set an offset. This can be done in the menu teach in with the item offset. It is now possible to define an offset in millimeter steps from the current switching point. As an example 70 millimeter is chosen as an offset from the switching point. The setting has to be confirmed by the set button. The switching point has now been moved successfully by 70 millimeters. In some cases it might be necessary to ignore certain areas of the label during the teach in. This can be done by the so called blanking with the item blanking in the menu teach in. Up to two areas can be defined by setting a start and an end point. As an example area 1 is now defined from 50 to 100 mm from the current switching point. The defined area will be ignored with the following recalculation of teach in data. If the label is changing in this area, for instance by a printed best before date, the quality of run keeps stable and an accurate switching is assured. The setting of the blanking is confirmed by apply and the teach in is recalculated. In this tutorial the complete process of a teach in offset and blanking has been presented. The configuration by Sopas Air is shown in a separate tutorial.